Hey guys, welcome back to the Start Your Fashion Business channel. My name is Stephanie and I am the host of this channel. If you want to learn about all things fashion business, then you have come to the right place. But before we move on with today's video, I want to quickly share with you the secret of how people are earning up to $72 for each $1 spent. And so the answer for that is by using this email marketing platform, which is called Omnisend. It combines emails, SMS, and web push notifications, making the most for e-commerce brands. So you can combine all of those channels in one workflow, and you can even automate the entire process so messages continue to get sent even when you're doing other tasks. More than 100,000 businesses are already using Omnisend to grow, and I'd strongly recommend that you do too. Their award-winning customer support is available 24-7 on every plan, so whenever you have questions, they're going to be there to help you on your path to success. So try it out yourself. Just click the link in the description box below to sign up for free. All right, so today I'm back with some juicy tips for your fashion brand. I'm gonna be diving into the ever evolving world of social media and share with you my updated strategies for 2024. So if you wanna beat the algorithm and increase your brand presence and get more sales on social media, then this video is for you. First off, social media is your golden ticket to visibility. And the best part, it's that it's free. Yep, zero advertising dollars are needed. But here's the catch. You've got to know where your audience is hanging out. Is it Instagram or is it Facebook or TikTok? Now, once you've got that nailed down, then you can start pumping out content that speaks directly to your audience. So take a page from Sporty and Rich's playbook. Emily Oberg turned her Instagram into a mood board of 90s nostalgia, and the response was phenomenal. So if you have a brand concept brewing, secure those social handles ASAP, but what do you post? So let's talk about content. Sure, your end goal is sales, but bombarding your audience with sales pitches is honestly a one-way ticket to the unfollow button. You need to have a balanced mix of promotional, brand building, and audience engaging content. Now, if you're not sure where to start with your branding, I've got a free masterclass for you that's gonna help you craft a brand that resonates with your audience. And trust me, solid branding is the key to social media success and brand success. So if you wanna join this masterclass, just check out the link in the description box below to join for free. Let's talk about what's hot for 2024. Carousel posts to tell a story and to communicate your aesthetic is a way to keep your audience engaged and also be nurtured at the same time. You can do so much with a carousel post, like sharing a collection of photos of a specific piece seen on different customers, or a storyboard of your collection, or maybe a valuable piece of content that your audience will save, such as a styling tip or a guide that is obviously on brand. So think about what pieces of content that your customer would also like to binge on that is not necessarily content with the objective to sell rather than the objective to build your brand. Now, another hot tip is to add a song to your post because it's going to give it a whole other experience when your audience is flicking through your carousel. Reels are still bringing a lot of traction right now, especially short ones that loop because the more you watch, um, the more the reel gets watch time and the more Instagram is going to reward you and will push out that reel. Now, the key is to find a trending audio and then to add in a short video preferably around six seconds or less with a long caption where you are explaining the story or the vibe or the inspiration or maybe even the features of the product. The caption should be long enough that the video will loop a few times before the audience finishes reading your caption. And unless you've been living under a rock, there is a trend right now on Instagram with faceless content, which honestly makes things so much easier for you. If you are stuck with real creation for your brand, then this is it because you can literally make a cute reel and not have your face in it. 
I created this reel a while back before this was even a trend, and it is still one of the best performing reels for my brand page. And it's basically me wearing this cute knit set, which is one of our best sellers. I took that piece of content against a simple white wall, and honestly, you can do this, and you can recreate this, and I bet you will see good results, especially when you pair it with a trending sound. Speaking of trends, if you are a brand owner and you feel stuck with content creation every day and you don't know what to post because social media is maybe not your thing, then I have something for you. So inside my fashion business membership community called the Self Made Circle, I'm going to be dropping fresh content ideas each month so that you will always know what to post and how to go viral. I'll be sharing trending audios, content inspo, and all the latest strategies for you to beat the algorithm. The membership is month to month, so you can join and you can cancel anytime, but I'm sure you will want to stay, especially if you want to improve your visibility online, because let's face it, more visibility equals more sales. So if you want to join, I also left a link below inside the description box. Oh, and if you join with the annual plan, you're gonna get a hundred, yes, a hundred social media templates for free. Yep, not only will you know what to post, but you will also have a done for you template that you can customize for your feed. So it's always going to look amazing. Anyways, before I go, I also want to talk quickly about live shopping because this is another thing that is blowing up right now on social media that brand owners need to pay attention to. So if you're on TikTok, start a live and showcase your collection to get some traction and get feedback. And if everything is positive, then go all in with TikTok's live shopping feature. So with this feature, it's going to enable brands to showcase products in real time through a live stream event where users can seamlessly make the purchase within the app. And this is gonna foster interactive engagement between your brand and your customer. TikTok compares this live stream shopping to traditional TV shopping like QVC and the Home Shopping Network, but with a modern twist. And leveraging the immense reach that they have, they also attract a substantial younger audience. So if you wanna tap into a younger audience, then pay attention to this and try it out because it's definitely going to be a game changer for you. Interactive content is the way for 2024. So even if you cannot do live shopping, implement other ways to engage, such as polls or quizzes and AR filters, because it's all about engaging your audience in a fun and interactive way while also gaining valuable insights into their preferences. So how do you put all of this into action? So it's all about consistency and engagement. So schedule out your post in advance, and that way you're gonna avoid the dreaded post paralysis. So aim for at least a week's worth of content lined up. And remember, engagement is the name of the game. So create meaningful engagement with your audience to really build your online community. And speaking of engagement, if you enjoy this video, take a screenshot of this right now and post it on your Instagram stories and tag me at Start Your Fashion Business. That way we can connect and I will repost you. And don't forget to subscribe to this channel too if you enjoy this type of content and give it a thumbs up to show me and this channel some love. I appreciate you. And if you need help with slaying your social media game even more, remember that I'm here. And I'll see you in the next one.